It's a windy night here in Whitehall as the Trojans take on Three Forks. Three Forks is looking for their first conference win of the season. They're one in five on the year, as well as Whitehall is looking for their third win of the season and to make a playoff push. Let's get to those highlights. It was senior night for the Trojans, so you know they would be fired up. However, it would take a while for Whitehall to get things going. But early in the second, Brendan and Wagner provided them with a spark, returning the punt deep into Wolves' territory. A few plays later, Brody Becker would help the Trojans capitalize, punching it in on the ground. Whitehall up seven. That would get the Trojans going as a few minutes later, sophomore quarterback Miles Haroff would air it out to senior receiver Flint Smith for a touchdown. Whitehall takes a 14 to nothing lead. Less than two minutes remaining in the half, Becker would rush for a nice gain to put the Trojans in good field position. And on the next play, Haroff throws it up for a senior receiver, Evan Wagner, for a touchdown. Trojans go up 21 at the half and would never look back. They go on to win 42 to eight and have won three straight. I caught up with Whitehall head coach Dan Lacey for his thoughts on the win and next week's opponent, Big Timber. You know, we, we started off a little slow, a couple penalties to start the game out and gotten some long down and distances. Our defense helped us out a ton early. And then we started connecting on things that we knew would be there. And uh, our guys came together and, you know, stayed balanced. That was the big thing of the, of the night, to stay balanced. We knew they were going to load the box and, and be ready for our ground game. And we were able to hit them on the pass a little bit. And it opened up some of our running game late in the second quarter and then throughout the second half of the game. You know, they're a hard-nosed team. They love to run the rock. It'll be a great matchup up, up front. They've always been well coached. In the run game they have a, a, a different style than you know the typical 5b schools they kind of spread it out a little bit more so we're excited to see what you know what that game's going to look like and uh be able to see what what defensive and offensive front comes to play and i think that'll be the key in the game is is what one steps up and makes bigger plays in whitehall john miller mtn sports